Guys, I just quickly wanted to show you awesome that I found. I recently found this person on this website, Etsy.com, that is made of 18 million Rand in orders doing this. That equivalent to $1.2 million that this person has made so far doing this. I'm going to explain to you exactly what she did. Just a disclaimer, I know this video is titled How to Make $1.2 Million. This is not just quick money. This person has done this over a couple of years and it has taken some time. But in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how this person got started and how she scaled to over a million dollars. What's going on, fellow entrepreneurs? My name is Jay from the channel Million Mindset. This channel is all about entrepreneurship, making money online, building an online business, and working from anywhere in the world. And also, I love talking about goals, getting the right mindset, building an audience, and building a real brand online. So if you want to get tons of daily free courses, free videos, and free training videos on exactly what I'm doing in my personal life, to make money online or discovering what other people are doing and teaching that on my channel for free, make sure to go down below to the red subscribe button and subscribe and put that bell on so that I can send you a personal message every time I upload a value packed video just like this one. If you guys want to get the 17 video Snapchat marketing course completely for free, I paid about $87 for this. And I am now giving this away on my channel completely for free just to give you a boost in a simple way of getting some traffic and a younger audience traffic with Snapchat. So if you want to get this giveaway, all you need to do is leave a like on this video, subscribe down below with the bell on, I can see if you subscribed or not, comment down below that you're ready, and I'll reply to your comment with the link to this page where you can go and download this completely for free. But without further ado, we're gonna get straight into the strategy and waste no time. So let's get started. All right, so this particular website over here is called Etsy.com, which is a marketplace where people People mostly sell digital arts, dolls and miniatures, mixed medias and collages, fiber arts, photography, acrylics, paintings, drawing and illustrations, collectibles. So you can mostly see it's got to do with art and collectibles. You can also sell stuff such as clothing and shoes, home and living, so anything in that kind of niche. It's quite a unique website if you want to get traffic and if you want to get people interested in this kind of thing. And I actually found this person over here that sells these abstract figurative painting on canvases for $48,000 uh, Rand a piece. That's about $3,000 a piece. I know that's a lot, but a lot of art Artists like this kind of stuff and artists especially the more older audience has money to spend on art like this and they have had a minimum of 373 orders which is a total of 18 million rand which converts I did the translation here on Google uh, Finance to $1.248 million that this person has made off of Etsy so far obviously there's a lot of other people here such as this person over here who does a ballerina watercolor art print for 166 Rand, which is about $10. And they've got over 1,600 orders so far. So if I go $11, which is equivalent to 166 Rand, times 1,601 reviews, they've earned a minimum of $17,000 just off this little gig doing small little watercolor art paintings. It's as easy as that, but I wanna show you a trick that these people are doing because some of these people actually aren't doing this work themselves. It's actually quite an incredible trick that I use to run full-time service agencies around the world. But make sure to keep watching so that you can learn exactly how this is done. If I actually click on this person's gig, you can actually see how many totals, wow, they've actually gotten well over 66, 000, uh, 1,600 reviews. So if I actually take out the calculator again, and I go $11 times, 21,085 sales. This person has made over $231,000 doing this, not rands, dollars. The reason why this website is in rands because it's my local currency, it picks that up from my IP. So again, if I actually come over to this person over here who's selling this canvas for over 48,000 rand, they've so far got 823 orders, that's 48,609 multiplied by 823. <laughs> this person has made 40 million rand just selling canvases like this. I know this is a lot and sounds ridiculous, but the stats are here. Let's just go 40 million rand. That is 275. That is that is 2.7 million dollars that this person has made off this Etsy gig over here selling this abstract figure painting. So it's actually a lot more than what I thought it was. I didn't realize this website actually gives you the specific sales over here. This pretty much explains here in black and white what the potential is of doing something like this. Now, like I said, it's taken these people years to get here, to get thousands of reviews, to get to where they are. It's not something they just quickly posted a gig and it happened overnight. It took time, consistency, 
like I'm going to explain to you on how you can do this too. So this is what you need to do. Just click on the sign in button at the top right over here. You can click on register if you don't have an account, fill in the following information. I'm just gonna sign in with my Google account. Once you've signed in, click on the top right on your account and click on sell on Etsy over here. There's a big button that says sell on Etsy. You'll see it will take you to a web page like this. Open up your Etsy shop. That's all you need to do. You can choose your language. I'm just gonna choose English because I'm English. You wanna choose your currency or your country and then choose your currency and watch which of these best describes you. You can say selling is my full-time job or part-time job. Um, you can just choose, for example, selling is my full-time job. You're gonna click on save and continue over here. You can enter your shop name. So we can go, for example, millionaire, or let's just go Jay Froneman. Jay Froneman, we can use my name and we can click on check availability over here. This is available, so we can click on save and continue if your shop name is available. And all you're gonna do is click on add a listing over here. So you need to add stock to your shop. You wanna add as many photos as you can possibly. A primary photo and every angle, um, details, the size and scale and style and scene. You don't have to add all of these. This is just a recommendation on what kind of photos you should add to your Etsy shop. But I'm going to show you exactly where you can get all of these images without actually worrying. Over here, you can also add a video as well. If you want to, I'll show you how to get free video content for your Etsy shop as well. And then for the listing, you've got your title about this listing, who made it, either you did it, a member of my shop, or choose another company or person. What is it, a finished a supply or tool to make things? So most of the time you will select a finished product. When did you make it? You can choose recently or ready made to order the category. Obviously we're gonna choose a category in a bit. I'm gonna show you how to identify the perfect category. Over here we can do real new options, automatic. So this listing will renew as it expires for 20 cents each time. Otherwise you can manually renew this Etsy gig when it expires. For your category, you can choose whatever your category is. I'm gonna advise you now on what category you need to choose. The type can be a physical or a digital product. Most of the time, it'll actually be a digital product. For the description, I'm gonna show you where you can get this as well, when you can actually literally copy and paste the description here so you can sell it as is. So you don't need to actually think about anything and type it out yourself. For a production partner, you can actually add, uh, for example, a location of a business or whoever helps you produce your products. You don't actually need to worry about that. For the shape, color, and style function, you can add different colors or shapes that I'm gonna show you how to get as well. For your pricing, I'm gonna show you exactly how to get that now as well and advise you your quantity and your um, code unit for your stock. So for the digital files, if you want your client to download any digital file after they order off of you, you can do this as well. But this is what we need to go to do to go and enter all of this information. Make sure to pay attention to each and every step that I'm about to show you. The first thing I need you to do is I need you to come over to Google and search the term Payoneer. Click on the first website that says Payoneer Get Paid Global and Worldwide. So this is a website where you can create virtual bank accounts. So I've got a virtual bank account in the United States, United Kingdom, and I think Ireland as well, which helps to get paid around the world. So this is very handy if you're an online entrepreneur and want to get paid in different currencies. And it's completely free to sign up. Obviously, if you want to verify your account, you need to submit your ID, proof of address, and that kind of information just to prove that you're a legitimate person in this world. Very easy process. I've already signed up with my account, so I'm gonna sign in with my account and show you how the bank accounts work. Over here, you can see on my dashboard on the global payment service option, I have a UK bank account, a USA bank account, a Eurozone bank account. I can add a Japanese bank account, a Singapore account, and a Canadian account as well, where you can request more receiving accounts as well. So like I said, this is very handy if you want to make money online in different currencies around the world. So I suggest go sign yourself up an account on payoneer.com. Once you've got your account ready to sit and go on Payoneer, come over to fiverr.com and you wanna search anything in the arts and crafts niche. So we can go, for example, come back to etsy.com and we can go type in, for example, let's type in glass art. So let's just type in glass art, click on enter, see what comes up. So over here, take a look at this. I will make your pet in vector art for displays, clothes, or glasses, etc. I will draw glass art style landscapes. I will create a kawaii crystal glass art. I will abstract animation art glasses. So over here you can see um, this person over here, I will draw a unique stained glass token crypto art. They've already got seven orders at 4.9 star rating. So that's a good rating. Now this person is charging $381. So we can open up their gig and just read through more about what they offer. Now. What a lot of people actually do is, and, and you don't even realize it yourself, a lot of people that offer these kind of services on these websites don't even do the work themselves. They outsource it or they drop service it 
through suppliers at huge markup. So this person over here has a done for you description that you can actually use already, a done for you title that you can use for your Etsy page over here. And the price currently at 381 Rand, we can just go and put for example, at 780 Rand, which is over 100% markup. Obviously, if it was in dollars, you're just using dollars. So let's say it was $30 here on Fiverr, you can put it for $60 on Etsy.com. For your title, you just wanna go over here, uh, I lost it here, the title, you wanna go, I will draw a unique, you can just use this as your title. Who made it? You wanna be honest and you just wanna say uh, somebody else or another person. When was it made? You can say made to order. For the category, we can go uh, glass, it was glass art, glass art over here. There we go, glass art in sculptures and figurines. You just wanna choose glass art, there's your three ca There's your three categories over here. For your primary color, you can just go, uh, I would choose, this looks like purple, so just go choose purple over here. Uh, purple, pink, not pink, purple. Secondary color, you can just go choose, for example, have a look at the pictures. It looks like there's quite a bit of black, so let's just go, um, black over here you don't have to worry about any of these optional options over here i would say just choose purple or black for the mount type don't worry about that renewal options you can choose manual or digital for the description you can literally just copy this copy that and paste that for your description over here so that's pretty much sorted for you that's how you can drop service off of etsy on fiverr.com now whenever you post this store um onto etsy.com and you get a couple of views you maybe want to create an instagram page in the glass and art niche or the glass and art um, token crypto like a theme page on instagram and you put that link to your etsy store in your bio so people can actually go and place orders on your bio on instagram every time you get an order all they do is you come over to this person over here i suggest save this gig or store it on your browser and place an order with them transfer this work to your clients on etsy.com and you keeping over 340 dollars over 300 rand or aka 40 dollars in your pockets for doing so so that's how drop servicing works you're the man in the middle you're not doing any of the hard work so over here on the screen i've created an entire free training on the drop servicing university which is an entire digital university where you can learn how to sell rare high income skills that people pay hundreds to thousands of dollars for for example someone charges you for a website for let's say 5,000 Rand or $400 that you've now promoted on Facebook Marketplace or Gumtree or through Google Ads or Facebook Ads, all you'll go and do is you'll go to Fiverr, get somebody to design that website for you for let's say only $100, you keeping $300 in your pocket. Now the whole key to succeeding with this is why do people just not go to Fiverr and place orders there for $100? The thing is, if you can promote to them that you're a professional, good looking company page with good branding and a good quality service, they will rather buy for you than some random guy on Fiverr. So this is all about branding and this university or training is 57 in-depth one-on-one mentoring videos on how I build my successful drop servicing stores. I had a huge um, Easter weekend special, I think it's still going or extended for the next couple of days where you can actually get exclusive access inside this course and view what's inside, plus a free training, plus 80% off. All you need to do is come over to the first link in the description. It will expire in about a day or two with the special and free training. Sign up for that free training and you'll see how to get access over there. So make sure to go over to the first link in the description and also don't forget your giveaway in this video. But without further ado, I'll see you on the inside over here.